So um, we're geocaching today and we are in Ridgeway in Sheffield and we're at um, St John's the Evangelist. So I'm here with Kooky Cat. <laughs> Check out her channel. She's also started geocaching and um, it's a bit kind of miserly today. A little bit of rain but hopefully it'll not get too bad. But they're at this beautiful church um, here in Ridgeway and Kooky Cat Katie has got a trackable uh, geocache that we're going to drop in somewhere around here. So I'll see you later. Bye for now. A cheeky carvery. <laughs> um, we've just been to Elmwood, which, if you fancy a carvery and it's if you're in the area near the Rother Valley, definitely worth coming. It's our regular hunt, um, and they do really, really good you know, uh, carveries here and other meals and breakfasts and all sorts of stuff. So it's definitely worth coming. Uh, not sponsored, by the way. Right, we're off now to go and find some geocaches. <laughs> and probably get very muddy because we're going off towards the Rother Valley. Right, okay, so we're going to try and find our first geocache which we think is somewhere in this area. So, be right back. Okay, so we found the uh, geocache. So, we just opened it and we're going to sign it. Okay, so we are across from the Elmwood now, it's kind of behind the roundabout. Um, you can see there's a Greggs and a Starbucks and what have you there. And we're heading this way, which uh, there are lots of paths this way, but it does take you up over to Rother Valley Country Park if you want to head that way. Um, there's a little bit of parking here, not much, but um, and it does get super busy. Let's see how long this lasts before my battery runs out. I think we have to go that way for the castle. We saw a, a bunny in it the other day. Yeah, our bailey totally ignored it. They were like, look, oh, baby, have bunny. I'm like, no, mm, not this way. It's so gormless. Beautiful ghost, I love ghosts. It's a bit prickly though, if you need a wee. <laughs> yeah, there's usually loads and loads of bunnies around here. It's really nice. And that you can see that they're replanting trees, the, the woods um, in this area. And you kind of head in this direction that we're going, um, and it, it'll take you on several paths. You can go, once you get to the wooded area, there's um, a path to the Rother Valley. So I think we're heading in a different direction, I'm not sure. Okay, which way, Clyde? <laughs> We're uh, just going to check the geocache app just to find out where we're actually heading. You can see we're just heading into woods now, it's absolutely gorgeous. You midges about. No. Might be able to hear the uh, Alright, okay. 
as you can see we're very skilled in map reading <laughs> actually I can read a map I can't read a phone <laughs> Beautiful gorse, cherries, cherry trees. Oh, everything is coming to life, it's so lovely. Okay, so we just found um, the next geocache which Katie is holding. It's a poo. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, and we've got a, there was a little bumblebee down here somewhere. I'm trying not to I stand on. I think it's going away. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, so that's our third geocache of the day. Well, what, yeah. the so get back to you in a minute. Okay, so we are heading into the woods, and we're looking for the next geocache, which is actually called Into the Woods. So I've got my little map up, I'm navigating, so we're off this way and it's it's a bit muddy. So where are we going? It's this path, it's like, it looks like it's the end, uh, towards the end of this path. Okay, so I'm navigator, so that means we're definitely going to get lost. Oh, it's actually temperatures dropped now. We've got uh, into trees a bit. It's really beautiful in here. Um, this is kind of the back end of Rother Valley Country Park. There's loads and loads of paths through here, and if you are into like um, going to country parks and stuff there's a there is a lovely caravan site it's really nice we it's actually 10 minutes from where we live but we have actually stayed there in our van um because it's really really nice um and we were nosy we wanted to see what it was like but um you can hire bikes down there you can hire canoes you can there's all sorts of stuff you know you can go water skiing so you can go on a bazillion walks really nice little bird is a creature in the ditches. No, I think the... Oh, what are you? Oh, it could be a cold tip. Starting to make the nests. Yeah, so get, get back to you when we get to the geocache. Okay, so we're um, just well, heading up into this is where I go my thing. woods and we might have some comedy action when Katie goes flat on the face. Um, so, uh, keep going, 10 metres still, 9 metres. Uh, ooh, it's wet. Right, where are we? So it's somewhere that direction. just going to follow this path a little bit more okay so we found uh, geo cache number four of the day it's a little bit brambly and slippery um, on that one at the minute um, so we're going to head on to the next one which is um, So the next one, the hundred and it's making its mind up, 182 meters away. So in this direction. Um, we're too flop now. Let's see if we can find this one. And so we're going up towards the river rather. Okay, so when <laughs> are you filming? <laughs> She has an itchy wolf. <laughs> uh, right, so we're heading to the next geocache and we're actually on the Trans, Trans Pennine Trail at the moment. Okay, so 
Uh, we've got us last geocache of the day um, and we're heading back, well we're hoping we're heading back, we're just kind of following the path around now. Kate is just doing a, a, a video as well, so you probably hear her in the background, nattering away. Um, yeah, so we're just kind of basically, you're walking along the side of, um, I think it's called Pit House Lane, and then on the other side of that is um, River Rother, which runs into the Rother Valley. The Rother Valley is actually the, one of the um, runoff areas in case of floods, um, which, you know, when we had a few years ago, both uh they did open some of the um gates up uh because of um the Ulley country park the reservoir at Ulley, um the uh bank there uh, was collapsing and the whole of the area was flooded so yeah so that's uh whereabouts we are at the minute uh, okay so we found the um, next geocache just gonna put his name on it and um, not sure if we're gonna head back or what we're gonna do I'm filming on my phone now because my battery's run out on my GoPro so okay see you in a minute bye